प्योर इंटेंशन ऑफ अ सॉन्ग इज टू मेक द लिसनर जिस फॉरगेट अबाउट द फैक्ट दैट दैट लिसनिंग टू अ सॉन्ग एंड स्टार्ट फीलिंग थिंग्स सो फाइ एम एबल टू डिलीवर दैट इ रिस्पेक्टिव अबाउट लैंग्वेज आई एम सिंगिंग इन राइट दैट्स द होल पॉइंट Hey this is Ritwiz I am a musician from India and this studio session is about how I make music creative control over track just seem like the most important thing for me every little melody passing melody that's going around the song even if like a listener won't like grab it immediately I cared about that so much but I just didn't know how to figure out about going on with the song so YouTube was obviously my place to find every tutorial on the software that I used today Ableton and figured out ways of expressing ideas when i am ready to like let the idea come to me right like if i am in that place i will go to my phone <laughs> vocal for me i'm very vocal driven my music is very vocal driven i figured out how i can use my vocals just basically as an instrument right i treat my voice as an instrument so i use laptop speakers right to produce because everyone's consuming music on like laptop and like phones and stuff so i'll always test my music on this liggy is an interesting song liggy i wrote before dur gaya at the time when i wrote liggy i was in a place where i could only imagine and and like express my desires towards like you know general wants of like human lives we're looking at 290 channels for me ideas are like like my children so i even if an idea doesn't make it to the song i will keep it so the first thing i like to play right in the song which i feel is in a way the crux of this entire song now i don't know if you recognize that already but let me play you with everything else yeah you can hear it in the back this is what like i in a way birth this entire track this melody right here when we're talking about like the instrument sections and stuff like i think i use very basic like again like i i'm using stock plugins and silent presets uh which are to my liking i feel like the right here like everyone will recognize this that's the baseline it's epic i think it 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 does its job and it gets me inspired and i i i started writing vocal melodies around this that's that's the drums you know that's basically it um this on a loop with the chords help me like compose all in all look at the jumps that i'm making usually when you like think of music it it needs to be a very catchy like four six note melody you know with with a drop you could go like da na 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 now that's it you know but we have a very complex melody so i needed like the simplest way to produce it you know here the drums are completely different than the drums in the verse of the song so the first half of the song and the drop they, they completely change the drums but the only thing that i kept constant was the perks this so this is something that will keep the listener like focused on the fact that okay you could have completely changed everything but if you have one constant thing throughout it'll keep it all in the family back in the day i think why i would call myself a rookie is purely because i would entertain i believed in quantity one idea should take center and you should do everything in your power to make that the most exciting thing ever what probably in the 10 years of making music you sort of train yourself not with 
how efficient you get with your music or how all the new tech and all of that doesn't matter what matters is you train your ears you will figure out all the required tools what you should focus on is do you have anything to say it should be a personal journey for you to figure out the 10 things that it will take to say the things that you have to say.